Hey yo, what is up? Uh, we're looking at Ansk, a remake, old Ansk versus a new Ansk, and a new Ansk is extra large. It's a big version of the old Ansk, and it is actually made, uh, in my opinion, a lot better. I like the way it looks, uh, and uh, if it feels as good as it looks, this map is going to be a big hit. And uh, I can already tell uh, this is going to be pretty popular uh, just from this video uh, released on the, uh, I suppose this is a closed loop test server or, um, you know, in-house uh, test map for the devs. It looks incomplete because um, all the little grass, the trees, they don't look like they're full HD. They don't look like... Uh, they're completed this looks like a test map uh, but from what i can see it's already looking great this is the nine zero line that they've added a river and a uh, lower ground you know a gorge or a coastline or a you know a river mouth or something like that but it looks absolutely amazing it looks like we can go down there with our tanks uh, the 90 line typically has always been a quiet place, uh, you know, open, very easy to get yourself killed if you are inexperienced, um, if you don't know the map, if you don't know uh, where the low spot is, where the high spot is, uh, it is very difficult to protect yourself from uh, shots from the middle of the map which is where we are now uh, middle of the map and the city is of course the most po popular places for all the heavies and the mediums um, you have clear shots into the 9-0 line where all the light tanks and medium tanks and tank destroyers are hiding and uh, it is not a good place the 9 line but with the new addition making it bigger wider further uh, more dips, uh, low ground where you can uh, access the north and south. Uh, you know, you can have some safe positions if you can make your way through the low ground, avoid uh, being shot from the middle of the map. Uh, this looks like a pretty interesting addition. What I do hope is that they do not replace the old ends, but instead uh, add a new ENSK into the rotation and call this ENSK 2 or improved ENSK because I think the old ENSK still has a place in my heart. It still has uh, a place in the game. It is still a viable map. It is still a pretty good map. Uh, it's not the best map, but it is still pretty good. It is playable. I do enjoy it. I hope they keep the old ENSK map and uh, just add an additional uh, new ENSK to a map and not do anything to uh, disrupt uh, what the old ENSK used to bring to the, uh, you know, to the battlefield, which I thought was pretty good. But uh, the new ENSK, it, it looks like they've just um, expanded it. They've dragged, they've dragged out the pixels and stretched it out and make it made the map uh, bigger everything is wider even the corridors um, the buildings are spread further apart the roads are a little bit bigger uh, you can see this is the sniper's nest that used to look down look down the uh, one two line it looks like it's been wider they've added some buildings a new row here which you can sneak through um but it is still an, another corridor but at least you have right now the new ends looks like there are four positions you can play here you can play the one two line you can play the regular city line where you are in uh you know the three four line and then you have the railroad line where all the tank destroyers like to camp out at the back which is uh you know the usual five six line and then you have the the town in the in the in the field with it which is the six seven line and then now you have the nine zero line so this is one two three four there are five six lines for you to progress and this is um a really really good addition uh i'm gonna go out on a limp and say this is one of the best 
uh, map improvements that I've seen coming out from the Wargaming devs in a long time. Now, they've been doing a lot of tweaks on their maps. So they've been doing a lot of things, um, you know, revamping their older maps, making new maps. Um, but in my opinion, I think this is uh, the best one yet. It looks unfinished it looks uh, you know there's still a lot of textures that they need to add uh, to make it look a little bit more organic look a little bit better but you can tell already it's looking really nice this is this used to be where uh, the heavy tanks brawl out right in the middle of the town and it looks it looks like the road is a lot wider it looks like there are more corners for you to peek out it looks like there is more uh, protection if you are uh, you know trying to side scrape or trying to poke out to get shots it looks like the roads are double the size uh, it looks like the courtyard is double the size it just it is just an extra large uh, ANSC map and at the moment I am totally feeling it and I think this is an really really good addition and a really really good improvement to ENSC, uh, uh, old ENSC but again like I was saying from the start of the video I believe that ENSC should still be maintained the original ENSC and I think ENSC 2 should be an addition to the old ENSC I think this should be a bonus ENSC uh, not remove um, the old ENSC at all my argument has always been um, you know we need more new maps uh, not just remaking old maps and trying to perfect quote-unquote try to perfect an old map you don't need to make it perfect you just need to make more of it and that is my opinion uh, I feel like uh, this is really good I think uh, ENSC 2 or ENSC XL is very very good but i don't want them to remove the old ensk i want this to be an additional ensk i want this to be an additional map not replacing the old map let me know what you think and i hope you enjoyed this video i'll see you on the next one Bye bye